Hey angels, how you doing today? Just a quick reading. Mm. I don't know if I got to go with somebody being my chair. Hello. Mm. A lot of people had a lot of fun or had a wing. Somebody feels left out. Somebody offered you an offer and you you declined the offer and they're feeling left out. Close the door, mama. Close the door. Close the door. I'm working, mommy. Close the door, mama. No, like, go out and close the door and come back. Please. Thank you. Thank you, mommy. <laughs> now close the door, mommy, please. Mama. Bye, honey. Bye. Goodbye, Mom. Bye, baby. Somebody is, is hiding something. A family. I don't know. Somebody is hiding something in the, in, in the dark, but God is bringing that joint to the light. You were asked to free yourself from the situation. Somebody is being sacrificed. There is some type of I don't know if it's soul ties, abuse of soul ties, and you are realizing the truth about something. If you have children, your children could be the one being sacrificed. For whatever this evil deed is for. There's an evil deed. Going on. Something about drugs. Somebody try to take you up out of here. Sacrifice the children. Lord, can I get something on sacrificing? Let me see. What you got going on. With sacrificing children. Mm. You gotta persevere through this situation. Proposal. Watch your kids. So, family, you are asked to join some type of union that will make you. At the cost of your children. Something like that. At the cost of something. I hear blood on your hands. Don't do it. Pull it up, Papa. Thank you, babe. Pull it up. This is what this started as a love frequency. But they didn't know that they did not know that you were highly intuitive. Close the door, please. There is an a, a evil offer on the table. It's gonna make you have to sacrifice something. Might be a brother involved. You need to pay extra attention. There's something you're not seeing clearly. Pay extra attention. To your enemies. Oh, somebody has an STD. You are of, you are of an angelic 
spirit. Somebody wants a reunion. I feel like these enemies, in real, in reality, in the truth, they are your enemies. But they're acting as your friends. Acting like they love you, but they don't. And they want you to take this offer and sacrifice what you got to sacrifice. You are losing more than whatever it is that you are. They are surviving. But you are living. There's a difference. And if you join them, you will be right along with them surviving. It's not worth it. But they, the way they making it seem like it's they making it seem like it's worth it is you having you having the icing on the cake and it's not and it's not the icing on the cake at all it's not it's not however they're drawing it to be it's not that at all it's not might be an aries in here you gotta work on something this is gang affiliated Somebody wants you to join their group. I hear a cultic, a cult. They want you to join. And they're making it seem like they're drawing, like, with nice feathers. Like, yeah, this, that. But you are going to be sacrificed. Some, you are going to sacrifice something that is really close to you. Okay? Because they are, wherever they're living, they're making it look like it's sweet. And it's not sweet. They are still surviving. They are still trying to um, make ends meet. And you are literally living. So there's difference. There is a difference. You sacrificing is going to add more to their pockets than it's going to add to you. That's the truth. That is your truth. And he has an STD. He's whatever. He's hiding an STD from you. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Your 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 spirit don't play about you. I just did I just did this last. I think it was with a was it a Gemini? Literally, nowadays people are awoken. They're realizing the truth. A lot of us, our angels and our spiritual guides, are not playing with us. They are stepping in even when we are still deaf. But once you realize the truth, they are even more alive. Because you, when you connect yourself with your angels, when you connect yourself with your ancestors, when you, when you connect yourself with your higher self, when everything is connected, there is no playing around. None. Okay, free yourself. And this person is really close to you. You need to persevere through this fake love. Fake love, a lot of black magic. So today I'm talking about the darkness is coming in quicker than we think, bro. Like you are superhuman. Your spirit and your whole the armor, the armor of God that you got going on on you is superhuman. Came out twice. It's super, super bright. You are aware. You are aware. And everybody else is aware. Imagine when you don't know what you got going on. People see what we got going on before we even know it. People see our power or how big our power is before we even know it. Now, we're, now when you start to sit in that power and you start to identify yourself with that power, stop playing. Now you are a threat. Now you are a threat to these people. To these people, you are a threat. They are trying, oh, they're trying so hard to bring you down because you are a threat to them. If you have been living some type of torture, some type of, um, I hear discrimination, it's because you are a threat. People, nobody will want to come and kill something that is already killed and something that is already dead. So when you have somebody running after you, when you have somebody chasing you, and when you, when you have somebody literally trying to bring you down using whatsoever power that they have left within them, because that's all energy. Even to, even to talk is a lot of energy. To do anything, you have to consume energy. To eat, you have to consume energy. To hold a friendship, you have to consume energy. Do you know how much energy you have to hold to have hate for somebody in their heart. Now ask yourself, why the f would you, would that person waste that, man, en that much energy on you? You are important. Stop playing. Don't let that motherfucker lie to you. I'm sorry about my French. 
Because I get real ratchet. They lying. Straight up lying. They lying. They lying in your ear. Sending all this, uh, I was about to say mosquitoes. All these flies with all these dead messages and shit. You got new money coming in. You got a new path coming in. Stop playing with yourself. You eat and then some. You blessed without, because you, you blessed without trying much, without sweating. And they want that. They want to steal that away from you. That's why they're in a rush to, to make you join whatever it is they want you to join. For that specific, they're tired of surviving. Now they want to live with you. But if you go over there, then the road's going to be switched. You're going to be surviving and they're going to be living. Point blank, period. Stop playing. They're not worried though because your angels, your angels ain't playing with you. They're toxic. Overly lying about the love that they got for you. They ain't got no love for you. It be first started as love, but now it turned into jealousy. Period. Because I feel like this person tries you somehow. They tried you and they're jealous. This is definitely not love. They're trying to get along with you so that you could eventually do whatever it is that they want you to do and move how you want them to move. If you ain't never met a narcissistic, whoever you're dealing with is a true narcissist. So yeah, a lot of manipulating. That is my story, my dream. I said my dream. <laughs> that is my reading for today. So health and wellness belongs to you. Don't worry about it. You are up angelic. You stay walking your inner light. Stay work work on your inner light. Stay with your inner light. You have surprise news coming in. You have to stop others. I feel like you know of somebody that's kind of going through the same situation that you're going through. Help her out. Or help him out. It's your girl, Maiva, a.k.a. Melly. Thank you for watching my reading. Make sure you give it a big thumbs up. Let it share with somebody that you know of. Maybe the story can resonate with somebody else. Time will come for us to meet again. Stay blessed. Bye-bye.